Hello, my name is Trent Mulligan of Avocation Systems, and today we're talking about pre-wiring for HDMI. Joining me is Richard Reisbick. Richard is an engineering design and manufacturing expert who's been involved in the audio video industry now for over 24 years. Welcome, Richard. It's great to be here. So one of the biggest topics of conversation in the industry today is HDMI and how to distribute it. Can you talk about the different types of pre-wire installers are using to distribute HDMI today? Sure, well the first one is standard HDMI cable, then they might use a CAT6 cable to go a farther distance. Uh, there are equipment out there that allows you to go over coax, then also optical fiber, and then there is wireless uh, transmission as well. Okay, well that's pretty easy. So what are the, some of the pros and cons of each of them? Well the first is HDMI cable. It has a distant limitation and you have to be very careful about the cable that's being used. Uh, to make sure it has the bandwidth for what you're trying to do. Sure. CAT6 has a distance limitation. It is uh, fairly inexpensive to use. There are devices required to get it onto the CAT6 cable though. Uh, Ethernet is inexpensive for cable. It is fairly expensive for the transmission methods. Mm -hmm. It is easy to terminate and it typically has a limitation of 300 to 1,000 feet. It does allow for electrical interference, but you can run audio, video, and control over it at the same time. Then you have the coax cable. Coax is moderately exp inexpensive. It exists in many homes today. Uh, the signal compression may exist on it in order to get it onto that cable and you probably will not get control features over that cable as well. It's basically transmitted as a television station. Right. Optical fiber is moderately inexpensive to, to use. It is easy to moderate to terminate. It has extremely high bandwidth for uncompressed video. Uh, it has no electrical interference at all. And you can all run audio, video, control, and ethernet on the same fiber. That's great stuff. Well, Richard, thanks for giving us some valuable information regarding the benefits of pre-wiring with HDMI. It's been my pleasure. For more information, tips, and expert advice on audio-video distribution, check out these sites.